Rally Round the Flags, Part 4. Fourth, Michigan, Cavalry. I had gone perhaps 15 or 20 yards when a trooper galloped up and ordered me to halt and surrender, to which I gave a defiant answer. Confederate President Jefferson Davis upon his capture by the 4th Michigan Cavalry. 4th Michigan Cavalry. 5th Michigan Cavalry. 5th Michigan Cavalry. 5th Michigan Cavalry. 6th Michigan Cavalry. 6th Michigan Cavalry. Fear not death, fear dishonor. Inscription on Guidon, 6th Michigan Cavalry. 6th Michigan Cavalry. Come on, you Wolverines. General George Armstrong Custer, 6th Michigan Cavalry. 7th Michigan Cavalry. 7th Michigan Cavalry. 7th Michigan Cavalry. Just then, a column of mounted men was seen advancing from our right and rear, squadron after squadron, with sabers gleaming and colors gaily fluttering in the breeze. It was the 7th Michigan Cavalry, commanded by Colonel Mann, Colonel J. H. Kidd, 6th Michigan Cavalry. 8th Michigan Cavalry. 9th Michigan Cavalry. 9th Michigan Cavalry. 10th Michigan Cavalry. 10th Michigan Cavalry. 11th Michigan Cavalry. 1st Michigan Artillery. 1st Michigan Artillery Battery B. 1st Michigan Artillery Battery E. There was more fighting over this battery than any other battery on the field. The rebel troops attacked 1st Michigan Light Artillery Battery E under the immediate direction of General Beauregard, who urged forward three regiments. Dispatch to the Chicago Times. 1st Michigan Artillery Battery F. At Richmond, Kentucky, the 1st Michigan Light Artillery Battery F was so unfortunate as to be surrounded by the enemy in the absence of proper infantry support, and all of its guns were captured, and more than 50 men taken prisoners. Record of service of Michigan volunteers in the Civil War, 1861-1865. First Michigan Artillery, Battery H. First Michigan Artillery, Battery H. 1st Michigan Artillery Battery J 1st Michigan Artillery Battery K 1st Michigan Artillery 14th Battery 6th Michigan Regiment Heavy Artillery 1st Michigan Engineers and Mechanics 1st Michigan Engineers and Mechanics 
Our country's flag must float over not a part of, but the whole land, with its stripes untarnished and its starts undimmed. Lieutenant C. W. Calkins, 1st Michigan Engineers and Mechanics. 1st Michigan Engineers and Mechanics. 1st Michigan Engineers and Mechanics. 3rd Brigade, 1st Division, 9th Army Corps, Army of the Potomac. 1st Division, 20th Army, Army of the Cumberland. 1st Division, 9th Army Corps. You have permitted no rebel hand to tear them from your grasp and bear them as trophies to the foes of our Union. Detroit Mayor M. I. Mills, July 4, 1866. 1st Brigade, 3rd Division, 5th Army Corps, Army of the Potomac. 3rd Brigade, 1st Division, 5th Army Corps, Army of the Potomac. 5th Division, Center, 14th Army of the Cumberland. 2nd Brigade, 6th Division, Cavalry Corps, Military Division of the Mississippi. 1st Brigade, 14th Army Corps. 2nd Brigade, Army of the Ohio. Dexter Guard. We have yet to learn that our state or a single Michigan flag has ever been dishonored upon a battlefield. Detroit Mayor M. I. Mills, July 4th, 1866. Credits, Research, William M. Anderson, Glenn Batchelder, Charles W. Bennett, Marty Bertara, John Braden, Paul Chardol, William Christian, Bob Koch, David Curtis, Lois Downing, Mr. and Mrs. Edward L. Dunafin Sr., David D. Finney Jr., Aza B. Esham, Gregory Colossa, Susan Key, Wayne Mann, Robert Myers, Pam Newhouse, Dale Neeson, Timothy Pack, Gary Pritchard, Linda Rosenthal, Charles R. Slay, Donald L. Smith, Mary Jo Varan, Lowell White, Photography, Peter Glenn Denning.